Put it back. Kiss me. No, no, no. <laughs> oh, good. I'm glad we're all here. All right, listen up. Somebody took my camera bag and I got four lenses in there and it's all I got left and one of you guys stepped on my back and took it and it's all I got left but it bears repeating because I'm 27 years old and last night for dinner I made rice aroni in my mouth. Give it a bag. This it? Oh great, thank you very much. Uh, 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 uh. Give it up. Give it up. We have a cocktail or two first, yes? <laughs> then I show you how a Serbian man makes love to... <laughs> Coffee, please. Two. Hi. Hi. You get a chance to meet the guys? Well, a couple of them felt me up while I was lying helplessly on the ground, but not formally, no. Well, this is Bobo. Whom you've met. That's TJ. That's Carmine. And that's Stupid Dave. Stupid Dave. I bet there's a funny story behind that nickname. Uh huh. <laughs> I'm stupid. <laughs> now sit down. All right. Who did this to you, hmm? Anna Nicole's bodyguard? Uh huh. He got me with one of those tinfoil to go swans. Oh, man. I've been there. That's why you don't see a lot of Pulitzer Prize chicks doing this job, you see? There's a lot of occupational hazards. Check this out. I got 15 stitches. I got thrown through a window at Penny Marshall's birthday party. Oh, I remember. Hey, here, here. Look here. Oh, yeah. Zsa Zsa Shih Tzu bites me on the foot. <laughs> huh? Check it out. Stepped on by the spiked heel of the artist formerly known as Prince. Oh. <laughs> it's rough. Three stitches, a broken thumb, and a staph infection. I bit myself eating corn. <laughs> so, this is the story? These people are famous, so they're above the law? They can just kick you and slap you and set dogs on you? And make you eat corn. <laughs> Okay, this is not right. You know why? Because it's the people who buy the comet that create celebrities. I mean, without those people, Anna Nicole Smith would just be another Stucky's waitress with a nice rack, am I right? Right, right. Huh, what about the little guy's right to know? I mean, I can't believe the arrogance of these stars who court fame so doggedly, and yet once they achieve it, start going, oh, leave me alone, leave me alone. Oh, but they love you when they're trying to sell their cheesy earrings on the home shopping network. Am I right? Right. right. Since when is the truth sleazy, you know? I want to know if Anna Nicole's knocked up, and I want to know in what universe does the woman find bras that size? Oh, God, because, damn it, this is America. The doctor will be with you in a moment. <laughs> uh, when you're done, just hand it to me through that little door. Right. Nora? Anna? Ah! What? You know what? 
didn't have to be like this. But... What, are you crazy? Hey, you might want to do a good down in the back. Terrific pictures. Yeah, save me the one where she gives me the finger. That's for Nikki. We had what was left of the urine tested. She's not pregnant. I'm sorry. It's not your fault. <laughs> so, what about the job? Nora, how would you feel if I sent you out to Mendota Heights, Minnesota to take a picture of a potato that bore an uncanny resemblance to Liza Minnelli? <laughs> Is that likely to happen? It has happened, Nora. I have the facts right here. Picture on it was a little grainy, but by God, if I didn't know any better, I'd swear that little spud was about to break into New York, New York. <laughs> so, Nora, would you feel it was a waste of your intelligence and education and talent to investigate such a story? So, Camilla, do you? Miss Slyboots. I like you. You remind me of me when I was your age. How old are you? I'm 27. That's odd. I'm 25. <laughs> okay. Now, Nora, I'm just mystified. Are you sure you want to try this? Honestly? Well, this wasn't the plan. You know, the plan was I was going to have a brilliant career. I was going to win a Pulitzer Prize and have three perfect children with my husband who's worth, and I swear to God, $30 million. But I landed just shy of that. <laughs> Look, is the job mine or what? Nora, check into personnel. You're hired. Oh, thank you, thank you. Because if I didn't get this uh, job, it was going to be... Nora, no, no, why don't you save this for some time when there's alcohol present? Thank you. Okay, just let me be perfectly frank. We've had problems in the past with people who've tried to cross over from the mainstream press. They come in here with an attitude that a tabloid job is below them. Do you think this job is below you, Nora? Well, Camilla, I still yearn. <laughs> How much lower can I go? We shall see, Nora. <laughs> we shall see. Hey, Ethics. At the gynecologist. Jealous? No, my hat is off to you. It's the fastest descent into the gutter I've ever seen. You know, Nikki, it's a pity you couldn't have been there. Because I had this woman... What? Backed up halfway down the toilet. I mean, the look on her face was priceless. I can see it. I mean, you had to have been there. I mean, this woman was terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> Half 